Boozy here, and if you're new to my channel, I'm Boozy, and we do art and get creative with it here on this channel. So if you like art, or you like to get creative, or you need some inspiration for some artwork, go on down and subscribe to my channel, because that's what we do here. Today I'm going to show you some watercolors, and I'm doing my Jackie, because being a first ever fur mom on my own, I really I am enjoying it. I love my boxer. So I'm going to use these that I got for Christmas two years ago because I don't know about you guys but when I get something new of artwork I get intimidated and I'm scared I'm going to ruin it so it sits in the box for a little bit until I finally get work up the courage and the confidence to work with it and I finally am going to do that today so let's get into it shall we hey everybody it's voiceover boozy and we're starting out with some pink because I went with blues, pinks, and greens and bright colors because you know I love it to be vibrant. This is a landscape, which is something I don't do often, and it's watercolor, which is something I also don't do often, so this is pretty cool. So I thought it was going to be really difficult because the sky was blue and the water was blue, but it's alright because we use different shades of blue and we use the water to our advantage to kind of fade the blue out and stuff, so yeah. There's some green trees and stuff like that. I decided to paint me and my Jackie on a bench because he's getting older, he's seven, and boxers are known to live till they're on about ten. They can last longer than that, but they get cancer and tumors and it's not good so it makes me really sad he's seven and he's getting older and I just wanted to have something for memories and I know I do draw him a lot but it's all right because we love him so here I am blending out that blue like I said earlier and then we go in with another layer of blue to darken it up and blend it into that lighter blue so it looks like a fade and there's no harsh lines isn't that awesome then you just go in with some darker pinks and darker greens to get the depth that you want of the trees and just add little details to make it look textured, well not textured, but just it gives it some layers and definition, you know, to make it look like there's actual trees or flowers there. And this was a ton of dots, it took me forever, I was just dipping it in the paint, dipping my paintbrush in the paint, and then doing little dots. And that took quite a while <laughs> for all them little dots, but it looks really cool in the end result. I think anyway, you may have a different opinion and that's okay. See, watercolor is really cool because you can use the same color over top of it and it just, it looks darker, but it's not. It took me a long time to get used to watercolor. When I used to do watercolor, it looked like a little kid did it for real. But understanding color and getting comfortable with the paintbrush and really getting comfortable with the water helped tremendously. Gotta do the shadows of the bench, cause the bench is white. And I think I had a black shirt on, but I went with blue so it wasn't so dark, cause I wanted to keep it light and not really cartoony, but I just, I love that splash of vibrant color. It just looks so pretty. It's just all coming together so nicely. I love it. Got color in my Jackie. He was all bland. And when I'm drawing and I draw an outline, to me it feels like I'm coloring in a coloring page. Like if you would buy a coloring book and color it. I draw an outline and then I color in the pictures and shade it and give it highlights and shadows and it's it feels like coloring in a coloring book to me. I don't know. That's just how I've always felt. Doing my hair. You gotta really take in where the sun's coming from and draw just the way the light would be hitting it. So that turned out really cool. I really was proud of the hair. Because normally I don't leave any white on the page, I always go over it too much and then use a white pen, but that's actual the, well, actually the white of the paper, so I was pretty proud of my hair. And now the bench. Yes, sir. It's coming together really nicely. 
And I made a mistake and went dark on this one side of the bench, and I could kick myself right in my behind for that. Added some purple for some little flowers. Just always add in more and more and more. It can always improve. You can always add something more. Go for it! Signature time! And here is the final result. I love it! Jackie, do you love it? Come here! Come here! You always do that that way. Come here. Jackie's got his own little section in my room where he's got his bed and some of my favorite pictures of us and stuff. So I might frame this and put it over there. Look! Look! Isn't it cute? Do you like it? Thank you! Thank you! You're so sweet! He always has to come and check out what I'm doing up here because I'm always talking to myself, to the camera. Loner life! If you liked today's video, please like and subscribe and come back for some more artsy fartsy fun. Thank you so much for watching. It means a lot. I gotta get down. Let me down. Let me down, big jump jump! Oh, there you go. You're alright.